up YouTube, it's Mac Mac here. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to make RAR files, so dot .RAR files. Uh, this video was requested by Shirin Simonyan. Sorry dude if I mess up your name. Uh, every time I struggle to say that name, I'm really sorry. But anyway, uh, thanks for the request. So basically, how to make RAR files and parts out of RAR files. So for example, here I've got three RAR files and if I extract those with your extractor, it doesn't really matter what. I'm just going to extract them quickly here. So it shouldn't take that long since it's not a, a big thing. But uh, here I just extracted those three things and then I got my video here uh, which I extracted. Uh, that was a promo we were working on a while back. So uh, so that's it for, uh, that's just to show you how to, uh, what what's gonna like, come out of this. So first off, uh, you'll need to download application and install it. So it's called Simplify, uh, Simply RAR. Uh, so I'll put a link to the description to the right and just drag and drop that to your application uh, applications and start up the app so simply RAR so once you start up the app it's gonna look quite a bit like this well it should actually uh, look like this and then uh, you're going to have obviously a file and then you wanna make a folder wherever you want so I'm just gonna call it promo and that's the folder where you're gonna extract it to Obviously, you don't need a folder really, you can extract them on your desktop, but then if you have a lot of parts, it's going to get messy and all that stuff, so. Uh, I'll just do it with a small file so it goes quick, so it's preview here. Uh, so it's the one I just did. Just drag and drop that to this main part, and then here you can uh, select the compression method, so store fastest, fast, good, best, and normal, so I just do normal. And here you've got a bunch of options. So delete files after, so once it's finished making the raw files, it's going to delete this file, which I'm not going to do. Test archive files, so it's going to test, it's going to compress them in parts and then automatically extract them again to test if it really worked. Lock archives, split archives, password protected if you want to put a password, and then include ar archive comments if you want to add comments, obviously. So here you have your file, and then I'm going to do split archive, and I'm gonna make 50 megabyte file, files out of it but of course you can do 100 or just uh, you want you can also choose in how much parts and how much MB but per part you wanna do that so uh, there we go I'm just gonna do split archives and I'm also gonna do password protected to uh, show you this works I'm just gonna do one two three four and um, say OK. So then I'm going to say create RAR and then I'll just choose where I want to save that. So I just made this map uh, folder and I'm going to call it promo. So then it's going to make the files so it's going to take a while. You can sit back there and just wait for this. So I'll be back when it's almost done. We're back here almost done. This is like not even a minute. Uh, you'll notice that at this uh, part of the thing it's going to get stuck for there for a while but it's quite uh it's normal so don't stress out or something so we're just going to wait for this it shouldn't take that long normally obviously it depends on the file size file size again so yep so there you go uh just finished uh extracting so it's going to pop up here a window saying process completed successfully so that's good and then maybe you can quit out simply raw and then here I've got my folder where I made the parts in or two. So there you go. You got my three parts here because it was uh, just over 100, I think. Um, so I'm just going to extract here to show you them. So you can do this with uh, with Springy, for example. So it's going to ask you for a password. So I'm just going to do one, two, three, four, and then you can do show the password here if you want so it's going to say OK and then you've got the preview and just drag and drop it to there it's going to extract uh, or you can do it with uh, what I prefer is NRX but apparently Spring is better don't know why or Tuffet Expander also good so you can do it with whatever you want actually uh, Pathfinder, WinRAR, whatever so then it's done and then I've got my movie and as you see that is the same movie as we got on my desktop here so uh, and the quality doesn't change at all. Uh, though what I recommend is first compressing this to a zip file and then making the raw parts. So then you you kind of save some parts, which is quite good sometimes. 
So uh, that's why I recommend. So that's it for this video. Hope it all helped you out. Uh, if you got any problems, uh, well, it should be working quite easy because simply, uh, simply raw is free. And again, put the link in the description and a few other links. So be sure to comment, rate, subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, thanks for watching.